Hi! In this video you will learn the most important basics of Infinity Maps in just two minutes. The workspace here is called the Canvas. If you now click on the Add icon in the toolbar, then suddenly a small card hangs on your cursor. You can place it freely on the Canvas. When you have created a new card, it is initially empty. If you now click on it, it will be selected and is also directly in text editing mode. That means you can start typing right away to label it. With Enter you confirm your input and end text edit mode. If you move the mouse over a selected card, you can see how the cursor changes. If you hover over text, the text edit cursor appears. If you click now, you get back into text edit mode. You can end editing with Enter or start it again by pressing Enter once again. If you hover over a selected card and don't hover over the text, you will see the hand cursor. If you drag now by holding down the left mouse button, you can move the card on the canvas. You can also expand the card by clicking on the triangle or by dragging the triangle to the desired size. You can also draw a frame directly when adding a card. And by this, bring your card to the right format right away. If you now want to develop a more complex model with Infinity Maps, you should start using nesting. When you click on a card, you can simply drag it into another card. You can also use Shift Enter as a shortcut to directly insert a new child card into an existing card. Once you start piling up big models, you need to learn how to navigate through them. For this, you have three options. First, you can move on the canvas by dragging the map. Then you can use the scroll wheel on your mouse to zoom in and out. Finally, you also can double click any item to focus on it.